Hurricane Thomas is on its way to Haiti, and before it hits, the International Organization for Migration has been moving people into safer shelter. I'm from the shelter program, I'm a program support officer. Uh, now we are here in Coral. Um, we are moving people from sector 3 to the city shelter due to the emergency. Uh, with me here are uh, one family out of this uh, 115 people here in sector 3 that are, that are going to be relocated to the city shelters. And so most of them, as you can see, are children and they are more vulnerable. And they are living in the tents here. As you can see, the condition of the tents is uh, it's really bad. One tent where family of eight members were living. As myself, I was living under one of these tents, and it, it was very, very difficult. It, it, that was very frightening situation when it blows, when it that when it is windy, or when it rains. So I think that these families are very happy to be, to be moving today from the tents. Moving people even a short distance is a complicated issue, and it starts with the registration of the vulnerable. Here an IOM staffer takes a careful count to make sure everybody in the camp is accounted for. It's a painstaking process, but it's the only way to ensure that the vulnerable are looked after. This family say they are happy, finally, to be out of the tent now that the hurricane is on its way. Autant parce que là ils sont ils se sentent en sécurité avec la saison cyclonique qui arrive. I come down from IOM. I'm uh, organizing the movement today. The relocation from uh, block two, block block four and three to T shelter. I'm here with Clotilde, and she just moved 30 minutes ago, and she's now doing uh, washing the clothes and everything. And we can see how she's really happy. And she's now in the, a t-shelter, safe for, uh, uh, safe for earthquake and uh, hurricane.